Hi guys, welcome to yet another MCQ. This is chapter number one, introduction to SCMP of CA final self-paced paper, SCMP or SCPM, whatever you want to be calling it as. Also to advise that please join our telegram channel for the updates. We don't put any useless information over there. We only try to be putting whatever is relevant for you all as a student. Okay, so let's see whatever MCQ you will have today. And just one last reminder, in case you want to be joining our complete course, okay, that is completely uh, ready for you all to be watching. You can see the explanation. You can see the details below. Once you join, lectures will automatically start. There is no need for you all to be calling. The details are all mentioned in the comments only. Okay. So let's see whatever question we all have today. Tata fab Tara Fabrics, considering the decisions regarding segmentation. Okay. Management accountant raised and said it was acknowledged that managerial discretion and judgment determine which markets are selected and targeted and which markets are to be ignored. You all will be knowing, I guess, because you'll have done your CA inter segment reporting. Okay. Segment reporting is basically every company works or supplies of products in various markets. Markets need to be segregated. Like, you know, India is one market, but then you have North, East, West, South. This is demarcation based upon the geographical area. Then like, you know, markets can be segregated based upon male or female. Markets can be segregated based upon the age. Markets can be segregated based upon say like, you know, whether the consumers are rich or they are poor, etc, etc, etc. It can be segregated based upon the need of the customer. Like, you know, does he urgently require or not? Okay, so all those things. In order for the market segmentation to be effective, like, you know, if this definition of market has to be good, okay, has to be effective, all segments must be, okay, give me the four options, please distinct artistic measurable and profitable second distinct accessible measurable and popular okay c desperate accessible many and profitable and lastly d over here distinct accessible measurable and profitable now before i say the correct answer in case you already know so this is the time to be commenting please comment below Okay, now uh, you all have commented. So let me proceed. Now, just some extra knowledge I'm trying to give you before I say the final answer. You can try to segment the market based upon geographical, as I told, like, you know, say North, East, West, South. Demographic, as I told, based upon age, gender, income. I told those things. Then psychographic segmentation based upon the lifestyle, personality, up and so on. Like, you know, some people in case of, say, Flipkart, filter the data from low to high some people filter it from high to low okay so these guys are separate these guys are separate okay flipkart sends different kind of notifications to all these people also behavioral segmentation based upon the occasion then the benefits the user status based upon the quantity based upon the loyalty status and attitude this is just for your reference you can try to segment the market based upon anything okay now, for a small example, try to be thinking that suppose a company spread across India. Okay. So, North, East, West and South. If it wants to have South as a separate market. Okay. If it wants to have South as a separate market. First of all, it should be distinct. Distinct means its characteristics should be different as compared to other three markets. It should be accessible. Means we should be able to supply goods over there. If suppose there is some kind of a legal constraint that you cannot supply the goods in South or suppose like, you know, your, you all sell lectures, okay, and your lectures are in Hindi, then they will not be getting sold in South of India. Okay, that's common sense. So therefore, then it is not accessible to you for whatever reason. Okay, measurable. You should be able to measure this entire market. What is the size of the market? How many consumers are there? Only then like, you know, for you, South will be important. And lastly, it should be profitable. Only then you are trying to categorize South as a different market. Okay. Rest every other thing that is uh, given to you. It should be popular. Okay. It might not be popular. It should be profitable to us. It might not be artistic. Okay. In fact, that word is very useless over here. Okay. So out of the four options, I guess like, you know, every company classifies that as a separate market, which is distinct, which is accessible, which is measurable and profitable. Exactly that thing is there in point number D over here. So that thing should be the correct one. Yeah. So that's the correct answer. Okay. That's it about this MCQ. I'll see you all next time with another one. Take care of yourself. Bye.